Sandra from New Locations Resource Adoption Programs, Lexington Facility. And with me here today, who may come around, is London House. And for our Trainer Tip Tuesday, we wanted to show you something that can come in great handy when you are in the most desperate of need. And that is learning how to make a makeshift halter that might get you from wherever you are to wherever you need to go. So I'll show you with two different types of lead ropes, one being with a chain. And chains are really handy to have because you, they are basically as useful or as passive as you want them to be. So London here, who is available for adoption, he'd be considered an early adoption, but he's on our website, which is forcedadoption.com. You can check out his profile, it says London House. And London House likes to play with his buddies and turn out, and what that means for him is that he tends to lose halters, they get yanked off his face or broken, because he just likes to be playful, so his buddies will end up breaking his halter on numerous occasions, which is, I mean, he, he plays, but it's not truly his fault, because he doesn't do it himself most of the time. So, to demonstrate, we can flip the chain so that it's in a circle, goes over their nose and then behind the ears and then we'll loop this through the chain on the other side so in that way and I usually loop it back over here since you're oftentimes leading in the left so it's a little more appropriate you can control the pressure so here's one makeshift halter and if you don't have a chain, so we'll get our handy Christmassy green lead rope. This one is a little, it's like a figure eight, but a similar concept where you're looping it over their nose, looping it behind their ears, and then I use the clip back under here so then you have another sort of makeshift it crosses under their jaw and there are lots of different variations obviously we'd love to see any that you guys come up with but although it's a simple thing you know it's something that comes in handy quite a bit and um, I think people would be surprised how often that um, can come in handy so it's good to know for when you need it so check out London House's profile and I hope everyone is um, having a great holiday season. Please tune back in tomorrow. We'll have a special virtual tour for all of you. But in the meanwhile, check out London House's profile at forceadoption.com. And thank you so much for joining us.